This is the second video for the MIT App Inventor uh, Digital Doodle. In the first video, we set up our horizontal arrangement for our app and did our overview. Now what we're going to do is we're going to come and set up our second arrangement. This time we're going to bring in a vertical arrangement. So this will stack things just like it says vertically. I'm going to set the width to fill the width of my screen. Uh, I'm going to come and grab a slider because I'm going to uh, use that to determine the length of my line. And I'm going to grab a label to put underneath. So we can see it stacked here. And the label I'm just going to use and say pen size. Now my slider here, I can set the values as well. Uh, minimum, maximum value. So I'm going to do uh, the width to uh, fill again. And I'm going to choose my maximum value to be 100 and my minimum value to be 10. And what that'll do is it'll translate to uh, the size of the line. So the label is just that a label. It's not something that we're going to code. Uh, so the next thing that I'm going to bring in is my canvas. And the canvas should be under. drawing and I bring in my canvas. Now this is where we have to figure out the size of our canvas. Right now it's set to automatic. I could fill my both my height and my width that's left. Uh, but again, it might be depending on how you design this. So this is where the drawing is actually going to occur. Now a few things that we're going to need that which we, we consider them to be hidden. Uh, we could come down here. We're going to need an accelerometer again to clear it. We're going to need uh, our camera option, which should be under media because we want our camera to be able to take our pictures. So what we have now is what we need basically for the setup of this. So this is our design setup. Again, you could change your options here. Uh, you're going to name your app, whatever it's called, under app name number screen one, and you're going to create an app icon you're going to want to load up. But the, now our design is here. So what we're going to look for in the next videos are how to program this uh, demo design screen.